Friendly reminder that yesterday when my mom took me to Walmart, she left me alone in the toilet paper section, and this guy started hitting on me, and I said, sorry, I'm a lesbian. And he was like, oh my god, I'm so sorry, I thought you were a boy. This was my Barbenheimer. Oh my god, they're so right. Personally, I went with Roblox oof because I needed to know more about Tommy freaking Tellerico. Please stop global warming, I don't look good in shorts. It took two hours of prodding, and you unraveled like an Ace Attorney character on Cross. <laughs> she said, no, my man, till I called her who can. Utterly incomprehensible to anyone who spends a healthy amount of time online. Fantastic. What? What happened to my dashboard? Why did they change it? This isn't natural! Put it back! There's something so satisfying about using ellipses like a boomer. I'm in a perpetual state of ponderance, ruminating. My mind a mere cow chewing grass in an open field. Motto Goblin, why must we play God? Artistic representation of how the lemon was invented in the first place. Look, you don't need threads. Citrus are such whores they'll cross with any other citrus. They're not choosy. Citrus are whores is not something I expected to see on the hell site today. I'm not wrong, though. They're easily the sluttiest fruit. You don't see Rosalie's pulling this shit. I mean, yeah, apples will breed weird new apples, but nothing fucks around like citrus. So we're slut-shaming the fruit now? Tags that look homophobic without context. I mean, technically, squashes are fruits, but they are also extremely slutty. Wait, is that why certain fan fictions are called lemons? Getting eight hours of sleep isn't enough. I want to slumber under the earth for eons like the old gods. This is a cry for help, please. One time I dreamt Gomez and Morticia Adams got divorced. I woke up mortified and with a sense of inexplicable dread. Yeesh, what a horrible nightmare. But no, those two, they were probably just divorcing so they could get married all over again. The urge to bother my mutuals. The urge is strong, but the social anxiety is stronger. Reblog if it's okay for your mutuals to bother you. Is it okay if I send you an image of Chalky Milk at 3 a.m.? You see, Barry the Platypus, when I was a young boy, my father took me into the city to see a marching band. No, 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 please don't. No, no, no. Skin is just people crust. Go back to the Doofenshmirtz doing Black Parade. Every day I wear my, I keep all my dad jokes in a database t-shirt on public, and every day people refrain from asking me to tell a dad joke. I've had like five locked and loaded for coffee shop employees alone! If I ever write something set in the United States, I'm just gonna do like zero research whatsoever and make stuff up to sound cool. It's equality. The lush, impenetrable jungles of Massachusetts. I wear a bra not for my own comfort, but to keep others safe. To keep them contained, for my tits are indeed not calm. As a child being told the moon controls the tides, with no additional explanation, I was like, Oh, okay, you want me to believe in magic? You're talking about magic right now. Oh, okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Of its proximity, but it isn't the only influence. The sun, with about 27 million times the mass of the moon, is always the gorilla in the room when it comes to solar system equations. But it's a distant gorilla about 390 times farther away than the moon. Sorry, only semi-related, but I simply wasn't ready for The sun is a distant gorilla. Thank you, Nessa. I had a dream that Tumblr added a difficulty slider, and when I went to the highest difficulty, my phone exploded. Oh man, that sucks, bro. Sure would be a shame if your phone exploded right...